Right, oh, today's job is uh, preparing this roof uh, for 17 panels, LG 390 watt panels, um, solar edge system, using solar edge because we've got a lot of shading here. This is up in Rolly Stone, up in the hills in Perth. Um, I'll explain more about solar edge and optimizers and that in another video. This video is to explain how we fit the tile, the solar panels to the roof on a tiled roof many of my clients will ask oh so how do you fit the panels to the roof um, and that's a good question so i'm going to show you so what i do is we use what's called a tile hook and you can see i've done most of them over there already and all these ones here but i've left this tile off so i can show you so this is our tile hook, all right? And that goes under the tile there and is fixed to the timber beam. Um, what I do when fixing these, which is what you should do, is pre-drill this. This is Jarrah, very, very solid Jarrah, but if you put a, a tech screw like that right near the edge, it's gonna split. So if you hear your installer up on the roof and you've got a Jarrah roof and you don't hear him pre-drilling it before he's tech screwing these in, then he's potentially splitting it and compromising the integrity of the tech screws. All right, um, I've also used a spacer on this one because the gap between here and there is too short. So if I didn't use the spacer, it'd be pulling down on the tiles and it would eventually crack the tile, okay? It's also important on these tiled roofs, especially these ones which are clay or terracotta, that you place the tile hook in the correct spot because put it in a different spot and it can uh, also crack the tile and you end up with a leak and then you need to take your solar panels off and fix the leak it can end up being a, a pretty big job so um, another important thing is that once the tiles are put back on they need to sit flush again so that if you get a wind come up this way and water on the lower line of tile hooks where the panels are the wind can be strong enough to force the water back up under the tile so we have to chip it out a little bit like i have done there uh, so that when the tile is put back on it sits nice and flush again okay i've been to many a job where these are sitting up pretty high like that and then the wind just blows the rain up and they end up with a massive leak and uh, a massive headache for the installer because he's going to get called back that's if he's still around all right so that's that's the tile hooks screwed in nice and tight two tech screws this is what we call our z bolt and uh, i'll be going down now and cutting the rails to length then coming up and fixing the rail to the tile hooks these just slot in to a groove in the rail that pulls it on nice and tight and then the panels just go on top of the rail all right so that's that that's how we fit tile hooks to a tiled roof cheers